Hi folks, we're back at uh, in the backyard of Sedona, Arizona, around 4,400 feet. And just a little close up here of point leaf manzanita. This is a plant that we've become familiar with in the Madrean Highlands. And as we can see also here in the Mogollon Highlands of uh, central Arizona, it is going off. It's actually about peak past bloom right now. You notice that the flowers are white and I can kind of make the corollas slough off pretty easily. It's a good sign that they've already been pollinated. Um, those of you from the east might recognize this as a blueberryish plant. The leaves are similar, the flowers are similar, and in fact, this is a, an analog to uh, blueberries and their relationship with white pine back east. Here, instead of blueberries and white pine, it's point leaf manzanita and juniper and pinion pine, sometimes ponderosa pine as well. The flowers play a crucial role in hummingbird migration. They're early blooming. It's only mid-March right now. These flowers probably started blooming around the 1st of March. And they provide a really important source of nectar for migrating hummingbirds as they're moving from Mexico up the Cordillera towards uh, Alaska and, and Canada. Notice the vertical leaf orientation of the leaves, something we talked about in class on desert plant adaptations. The point leaf manzanita has this in extremes. Almost all the leaves are pointed upwards, reducing the surface area and their propensity to uh, lose moisture in this dry environment. So just a nice close up of point leaf manzanita, a little bit about its flowers and relationship with uh, the beautiful hummingbirds we've been seeing.